Here are the top 20. 20 reasons the Detroit Lions will win the Super Bowl in 2019. We're actually going to fly through this list. There's not going to be a lot of time between reasons why the Detroit Lions will actually win the Super Bowl. I want to say a few things about each topic. We're going to fly through this list. I don't want this to be a 20 minute video. I'm thinking more like five minutes. If you guys want to see more of these where I do 20 reasons why, whatever it may be, 20 reasons why Matthew Stafford will win the MVP, whatever it may be, make sure you let me know in the comments below. Let's get this thing started. Also, if you guys are at day two training camp, that's when you will be seeing this video. Um, hope you guys are having fun. Anyways, I will have that day two video. I'm not exactly sure when because I'm moving around, but I will definitely get it out sometime on my takeaways from day two but let's get right into this video we're going to start it off the first reason the Detroit Lions will win the Super Bowl is that they are due it's simple they're due they haven't done it before they've never even been to the Super Bowl this team has won one playoff game in like the last 60 years we are due not only to make the playoffs and win a playoff game but win the Super Bowl we are 100% due there's a few teams but we're more due than they are why because I don't know because I said so I mean we, we really have struggled over the past we're due to actually have a Super Bowl and bring a ring that back to Detroit so that's the first reason the second reason is that they have Matt Patricia Matt Patricia has won Super Bowls before the Detroit Lions brought in Matt Patricia and not only do they have Matt Patricia but he's also in his second year he's more comfortable he's going to be really good with Detroit Lions 2019 the third reason is that we are going to have a top five defense in the league that is right we're gonna have one of the best defenses in the league this could be the best defense in the league statistically I think there's a chance that happens but I'm gonna play it safe go with top five and if they have top five defense we know how good Matthew Stafford can make this team coming in at number four the Detroit Lions will have also a top five running game yes I believe that is possible as well with the great running backs that we have in Karrion Johnson CJ Anderson Ty Johnson Theo Riddick Zach Center no matter who makes the team but our ability to block we have nice tight ends to help on the outside we have really good fullbacks so with that being said the Detroit Lions will also have a top five running game so that's the fourth reason now going into the fifth reason the Detroit Lions will have a great turnover ratio last season they struggled with a minus 10 turnover ratio into 2017 they had a plus five ratio we're gonna hopefully get that back to the pluses maybe get a plus double digit type of ratio because that would definitely lead to some success number six the Detroit Lions have depth and they struggle with depth before in the past at certain positions they would just like run out of players and it was like oh no now what are we gonna do but for 2019 it looks like the Detroit Lions have depth at every position very talented players that they can rely on I mean we're talking about a guy in Odeo Bushi who wasn't even playing with the starters at all and that's a solid offensive lineman so we definitely have depth and that's going to be huge as the season progresses and injuries start to occur for every team number seven is that the Detroit Lions also have playoff experience it's very important to have playoff experience players on your team not just playoff experience where hey we're in the wild card and then we lose like Matthew Stafford's experience uh, we do have a lot of young guys, but we also have guys from the Patriots, okay? And that kind of fits into the same thing. These guys from the Patriots have experience winning. Guys like Troy Flowers. All of those type of guys actually have experience winning with teams. So that's going to be really nice for the Detroit Lions to have. And not only do they have experience with players, but they also have playoff experience through coaches like Matt Patricia and Daryl Bevel. Now, number eight is that the Detroit Lions have a schedule laid out that is going to put them on a run, okay? The Detroit Lions have their first five games that are going to be really tough. They can start off very, very terrible, but they can go on a huge run. Some people have even said Detroit Lions can win their last 12, lose their first four, and finish 12 and four. That's some crazy stuff that would happen, but it could because their schedule was laid out that way. And you know if you get hot at the right time, that's your best chance to roll through the playoffs. So Detroit Lions could be exactly hot at the right time. Going into number nine, Detroit Lions have all Matt Patricia's guys. So Matt Patricia was looking to bring in his guys since day one he came with the Detroit Lions. He finally has really weeded out the guys that weren't his guys, and now he's brought in all of his guys. Daryl Bevel is the obvious answer of that one. Moving on from Jabal Kuda, bringing in Daryl Bevel. Matt Patricia finally has guys, so now they should be all on the same page. Coming in at number 10, so now we're into double digits, is that Matthew Stafford will have that bounce back season okay Matthew Stafford not a great season statistically in 2018 maybe it won't be outstanding in 2019 but it will be better less turnovers very very more accurate coming in at number 11 that is at the Detroit Lions now this is a kind of a goofy one but just just hang with me on here okay it's 2019 right so if you flip that around a little bit that could be 19 and 0 that's a reason okay don't tell me that's not a reason that's a that's a reason okay we're gonna move on to number 12 People are sleeping. People are sleeping maybe more than I've ever seen. People are saying that Detroit Lions are going to have the worst record in the NFL, which is crazy to me. I was thinking people would say, like, okay, maybe seven wins. Not three and 13. So with that being said, we're just due. Once again, we're due. People are sleeping on us. It's the perfect time to be the crazy, the miracle team. We're going to have posters of the Detroit Lions in 2019. Next up, we have a guy named Matt Prater. Matt Prater is clutch on his own. He could be that guy that wins the Super Bowl for us from 53 yards out. 
you know, whatever it may be, no matter the conditions, no matter how loud it is in there, Matt Prater seems to sink it when it's on the line. Matt Prater, you come in at number 13. I'm moving on to number 14 is a duo, and that is TJ Axon and Jesse James. The duo between TJ Axon and Jesse James, something similar that we saw with Aaron Hernandez and Rob Gronkowski in the past with the Patriots. So again, Patriot way, I guess you could say. Uh, but we have both of these guys that are going to be really, really good together. They both bring their own skill sets to the, to the Detroit Lions. Tight ends that really Matthew Stafford has never gotten to play with. So with that being said, they come in at number 14. Now moving on to 15, the Detroit Lions have the Patriot way. And you may be like, okay, you kind of just said that. But at the same time, some people want to say the Patriot way doesn't really work. It hasn't really worked before. But it could work for the Detroit Lions because the Detroit Lions are in a different situation here. Not only are they bringing in Patriots, but they're bringing in Patriots that are still young. They're not going to get the old guys that are like all washed up. And they're also bringing in the coaching staff from the Patriots. So the Detroit Lions are doing everything, maybe not necessarily the Patriot way. They want to say the Detroit Lions way, but they are using the blueprint for the Patriots. And that's not a problem. It's when you're trying to be the next Patriots. That's a problem. Next up, coming in at number 16, is that they could have the best special teams in the league. The Detroit Lions special teams could be great. You add a guy like Ty Johnson with that speed, we already have some of the best gunners in football, guys like Charles Washington. We have one of the best special teams between Sam Martin and Matt Prater. It's a huge bonus that a lot of team, a lot of guys usually forget about when they talk about football, but that comes in at number 16. Moving on to number 17 is a guy named T. Stabor. And they're going to be like, why would you put T. Stabor in here? Because he could be that guy. He's going to be our Malcolm Butler in the Super Bowl. When they go from the one-yard line, uh, you know, it won't be Pete Carroll, but someone else will decide, you know what, I'm going to throw the ball because we haven't learned from mistakes by the Seahawks. So they're going to throw the ball. They're going to throw a slant. And T's table will come with that game-winning interception. So you got to put all of T's on here. Coming in number 18 is another one-player person, and that is Trey Flowers. Now, Trey Flowers added to the Detroit Lions will be their best defensive line in 2019, at least sacks-wise, because he's going to have a huge boost being along with guys like Snap. Max Harrison, who's great holes, Aishon Robinson, some great linebackers. The Detroit Lions defense line is scary. Trey, Trey Flowers just made it scarier. Scarier. Yeah, that's a word. Coming in over tight 19 is that the Detroit Lions are finally believing and buying into themselves. They're spending money, they're buying into what they're doing, and they're going full 100% in it on it. They're pushing the pedal to the metal. You know what? If it doesn't work, it doesn't work, but we gotta go all in. And then finally, coming in at number 20, the 20th reason why the Detroit Lions will win the Super Bowl in 2019. It's because we're going to get lucky. It takes luck to win games, guys. Finally, we're going to get lucky. We have never been lucky in the past. Never, ever, 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 ever. I'm going to say like that. We've never been lucky. We're always so unlucky when the biggest play is on the line. We're going to be lucky finally. And it's going to come at the biggest moment. It could be in the playoff wild card game. But that moves us on so that we have a chance to play in the Super Bowl. And we win the Super Bowl. That is why the Detroit Lions will win the Super Bowl 2019. Let me hear your thoughts, comments below. Thank you, Prep, for watching. And I'm out.